Hey guys, it's Hannah, and today I am doing a back to school supplies haul. You guys love these videos, and I've done one for the past couple years now. So go check those videos out. I'll link them down below, as well as my studying tips video, because I have some items in here that might go along with that video. And you guys, I got great feedback on that video, so I will link it down below as well. Alright, so the reason for me not posting this past week, like I said I was going to continue posting, is because I was actually kicked out of my room for about a week. A little less than a week, um, but it's because I got my room painted, so if you can see it's like that color. I got hardwood floors, I got a new bed, which is right here, um, and I got, what else did I get? Oh, I got that. So I set that up and there's just a lot of changes in my room so with that being said I couldn't film in my room and I will have a room tour and an updated makeup collection and maybe like a closet tour if you guys want to see those three videos comment down below and like this video as well as like a fall clothing haul so let's just jump into this video I really didn't get a whole lot because I had some stuff from last year so what is her what is that I don't know. okay so let's get started so first off I just got a binder um, it's actually called the Note Binder. It's like from Five Star. It looks like this. I just got a white one just because it's basic and I'm basic and it just works. It's one and a half inch. Um, and with this, the rings, if you want to put something in, you have to like pop the rings out. Um, so you just open it and it comes with three of these like thicker file divider, index divider things. And then it comes with four of these little protector things and they open up like that and they just hold your papers right here comes with four of those and then it comes with lined paper and graphing nope that's not graphing graphing paper <laughs> so which i usually end up taking out the graphing um so yeah i just got this this is a really good binder now it is like depends on where you get it and if you get like on sale but it ranges from like 10 to like 15 dollars so it is pricier but i used this last semester like last school year i could have used it the whole year but i didn't know about it um and i could be using that one this year as well but i just wanted to start fresh um so it will last you a very long time because this doesn't rip it's super flexible the rings don't break because they're just rubber Everything is just great. The only thing that might break are these little plastic buggers like on the bottom. If you overfill them, the paper, it might kind of rip. So in that case, that's why I got these for like second semester or whatever. Um, and they're just the index dividers that fit that. I would have just gotten the Up and Up brand, Target brand, but I was afraid that they wouldn't fit the binder because it's a little bit bigger, but yeah, again, it's not. It comes with three pockets, one right here and then one higher and one in the back of them. And then there's just five of them. I don't know. I thought it would just be good to have in case they break. And then I got a five-star notebook. It is a three-subject college ruled notebook because that's what I prefer. Um, I used one of these last year. I think I had like a purple one. And it was great. I used one subject for English, one subject for math, and one for Spanish. And it was all I needed. So that's great. And I got like a teal color. Um, I got some index cards i got one pack of ruled and one unruled and these were in my studying video because i think they're a necessity especially in high school like when it comes down to finals and stuff so i just got two packs of those i might have to get another pack because i went through like almost three this past year um i got a index box like holder thing it's like a coral color i just thought it would be good for school like just to keep my index cards organized and for like when it comes down to finals and stuff, I can just bring this and just have everything I need. It might be nerdy, but you know, I really don't care. <laughs> um, and then for like pens and pencils and stuff, I didn't get a whole lot. Because if you saw my haul last year, I got a lot of pencils and pens last year. So this year I only got a pack of highlighters because I went through two or three highlighters this past year because highlighting is like key when it comes to studying for me. Like I'm when it comes down to finals and tests and I look back at my notes, I'm just like highlighting like there's no tomorrow so I know I will use these um probably this year and next year and probably the year after they'll last me so basically all through high school these should last me I'll probably only use like the pink yellow and orange though because those are what shows up the best I think and then I got these pens they're the Bic Soft Feel Retractable Ballpoint Pens 
I've never used these before and I'm hoping they're good because they were like seven bucks. Um, but they're just all black because I usually use like the ones that come in like the little plastic package for like 72 cents or whatever it comes with like 10 but I used like those all lash I used them up and um, if I wasn't writing in pencil I was probably writing in black pen so I think these will just be com more comfortable and hopefully just better all together and then I got these Papermate mechanical pencils they're the sharp writer ones I've used these but only like from other people I've never owned them so I'm hoping I will like them just because I like to try different pencils. Um, and I do like how those write. They're .7 lead and they're number two. So I can use them on standardized testing like Scantrons and stuff. And I do have like the really fancy $7 mechanical pencils from Paper Me, I believe. Um, I have like three or four of those so I wasn't going to spend like $7 on another pack. Alright, so that was all of my school supplies. I still need to get like a graphing notebook and stuff, but other than that, that's basically all I have and need, and I will talk to you guys in my next video. See ya!